All right, I'm going to show you guys how to do a screen recording on a MacBook. So I'm on a MacBook Pro 2012. This should work on other Macs as well. So let's get started. Go on ahead and hit Command Shift 5. So you're going to hold Command, then you're going to hold Shift, and then you're going to press 5. This is going to pop up, and you can choose what you want to do. Capture entire screen capture a selected window, or just uh, capture a selected portion. I like to use this one. I'm just going to select a portion of my screen. And um, I'm already recording, so it's kind of assuming that I don't want to record again. It won't allow me to. It's asking me if I'd rather do a capture. But for you, it will show record here. Um, now, one thing to keep in mind is after you hit record, after you press that, this is going to appear right here. And that lets you know that it's recording. It's helpful. However, there is a delay. There's about a five or 10 second delay. So what I like to do is before I actually start any um, recording, I just wait 10 seconds and then I start speaking. Another thing you'll wanna do is go to options, make sure that the timer is set to none, uh, unless you want it, of course. And then you'll also have microphone options in the recording section as well. And uh, I just use simple Apple headphones. Um, okay, so then the question is, how do you record yourself? So how do I use my webcam to display myself in this screen recording? What I'm gonna do is I am going to first exit out of this, but I'm still recording as you can see. I'm gonna open up QuickTime Player and I'm going to hit File, New Movie Recording, and this is going to appear. And then I'm gonna minimize it and drop it down here. Then I'm gonna hit View, and I'm going to put float on top. That means that it's always going to stay here. Even if I open up other stuff, it stays on top. So that's very nice. Okay, so there's that. Um, the next thing that is really helpful uh, is editing. When you actually edit a clip, I'll show you how to do that. Uh, let's see here. I'm going to take this, I'm going to drop it in there just so I can work on it on my desktop. If you just hit the space bar, it's going to open up the video. And then what you do is you can just splice it up right here. You don't need to open it up into preview mode. You can just hit space bar and it kind of does this quick view thing. And then you can just remove the beginning and the end, whatever you want. And then you're done. And you can, uh, and then of course, well here, let me not close. Let me hit done and then replace. And what it does is it creates that clip the way I want it. So uh, this might have been a little bit confusing, um, kind of showing uh, a recording within a recording, uh, recording inception, if you will. But I hope this was helpful. If it was, please like, my wife thinks I'm a nerd, I'm pretty sure. Uh, please like, share, and subscribe, <laughs> and uh, comment if you have any questions below. And uh, yeah, thank you.